Have you ever wanted to live in space? Well, a Dutch company called Mars One is looking for volunteers to fly to Mars and live there. The only catch is you're not able to come home. Today, the Mars One Foundation starts the search for Mars inhabitants. The search for people from all nations who want to settle on Mars. Mars One is a not-for-profit organization that is working on landing the first crew on Mars in 2023 and another crew every two years after that. The mission was explained at a press conference in New York. It will be one way only as currently there is no technology that would enable a return trip from Mars to Earth. The plan is to send four astronauts to Mars this year with the goal of establishing a permanent human colony. Takeoff, landing and various parts of the mission will be streamed on the internet and viewed by four billion people, according to estimates. Anyone can apply for the mission, but there's an application fee of around $40 that will go towards the estimated $6 billion required to fund the mission. I think it's an idealistic mission. Uh, this, is, this is something that can in my opinion, truly changed the Earth. Uh, if you remember what happened when, uh, when the astronauts landed on the moon for the first time, it, it also changed the world. Imagine doing this not just as one nation, but as the entire world. I do think that it can change the world. Applicants must be between 18 and 40 years of age and in good physical condition. However, there are no other prerequisites. Mars One plans to train the team for seven years before the flight that will take seven months to reach the red planet. Any big step that, that you take will always uh, mean that there is risk. Uh, space missions always include risk. and. Uh, this mission will not be different. When you send humans to Mars, there will be risks. The living quarters will have exercise equipment, televisions and internet access. Mars One will provide financial support to the astronaut's family back on Earth. The organization says it's already received inquiries from 10,000 prospective applicants in more than 100 countries.